WTFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials finish up 335. NASDAQ up 51. S&P's up 15. Gold. Gold contract up $34.80. Traded at 1715 an ounce. We have silver up 51 cents, 21 dollars 43 cents an ounce. Light sweet crude down 260. 89 dollars 19 cents a barrel. Notes and bonds. A 10-year note up 18 ticks. Had volume behind the move. They want to go higher, lower, low yield. 30-year held up one point plus eight ticks at 119.25 and King Dollar. King Dollar down us 600 and 468 ticks at 109.651. The euro is at one, the yen is at uh, 145, and the British pound is at 115 to one U.S. dollar. We get over, we take a look at the uh, S&Ps, folks, and the bottom line is that we have this uh, S&P. Let's see what volume we came in here. This is going to be a nice volatile night, and then we get the S. Uh, uh, okay, you had a small pickup of volume, which is good. Uh, yesterday, we only did... Uh, 68, we did 79 today. That's pretty good. You're going against 126, however, but 79 is good. A lot better than what we had, for sure. We take a look at the Qs, the NDX 100 inside the Qs. What do you have with the Qs? The Qs came in with uh, 60 million shares uh, yesterday. What you had is uh, 47 million. Uh, listen, I think this volatility is going to continue out here, no doubt. Uh, and the biggest volatility is going to be when the CPI comes out. You know, the elections are going to give us volatility. They've been giving them, well, we've had volatility, period. Uh, but it's going to be the CPI because it's all about, you know, the signature that our signature, what is it worth? It's all about the Fed. Uh, gold, gold went topside. You know, now, what we had here with gold, this is really cool, man. You had two huge signs of strength within three days. You know, Friday we went from 1631 to 1686, and today we went from 1667 to 1678, you know, bottom line, you know, you get three, you get, well, off the bottom here, in four days, you just went from 16 to 18, up 100 bucks. And it looks to me that actually gold, what gold has done is basically broken the trend line. I'm talking about the trend line right from the high. So you broke it with conviction. What conviction means, we have it in the gold market, is wide price spread accelerated volume. So that's telling me that this dollar is going down we haven't broke the, right now the dollar, it broke the trend to 104. So 104, 600th game. One more day of this, and then it's going to be 101 game, folks. And the bottom line is that, you know how this goes, it's the elevator up, no, it's the escalator up and the elevator down. That's what I expect you're going to have. Have a great night, folks. Have a safe night. Stay tuned for the Disney uh, numbers. They're not out yet. And stay tuned with Tommy tomorrow morning, 9 o'clock. Great show. Go get them, folks. Sharpening your 